guys they're on the background anyways today we got our last loot crate or crate of the amiibo crates or last amiibo crate if you want to call it and that's all i gotta say anyways let's open it last one. Oh my god whoa this is amazing this is amazing i got luigi and who else did i get who else did i get who else did i get oh zelda awesome so we got a new Mario character, we also got a new Zelda character. These guys look great. Mainly Zelda. I mean, Luigi looks as, as Luigi would look like. I mean, look at it. It's Luigi. And also, I'm kind of nervous guys, because this is my first time actually going to use a knife to open Amiibos. Because I want to keep the boxes. This is very creepy. I, I know this is very weird. But I'm a collector and I cut off the things and kind of treat them like cards and keep the boxes. Just in case I ever want to sell it. And that was my laptop. Uh, just, just an editing video. Warning me. Or like, notifying me that I edited a new video. Anyways, this is a booklet. Just talks about the Amiibos and the shirts. Super Smash Bros. t-shirt. Now, I am really excited because... Oh yeah, thank you. Thank you, Blue Crate. Shows all the figurines you got. This is everything we've got so far from Blue Crate. Three booklets, a sticker, a wristband, and a cinch bag, plus a shirt that looks very awesome. Now, why I'm surprised is because I was predicting that all the stuff we would get would be a amiibo, just amiibo on it, white and amiibo on it. But I thought the shirt would just literally be an amiibo shirt, white and says amiibo. But instead, it's a challenge you're approaching. Come on, that's awesome. Like seriously, that's awesome. I was like, okay, the shirt's gotta say Amiibo. No, they surprised us and said Challenger approaching. Wristband, Amiibo. Sticker, Amiibo. Cinch bag, Amiibo. Okay, you gotta think the shirt will say Amiibo. No! It says, new Challenger approaching. That's awesome. This is actually worth the loot crate, actually, to be honest. Look at this shirt. Super Smash Bros. for 3DS and Wii U. For Wii U, for 3DS. You know, Slash, because there's two games. That's awesome! Although I really wish the Smash Bros. was in the back. Yeah, that would've been awesome, especially for the Amiibo. Something on the back. Nothing's on the back for the Amiibo cinch bag. Hey, that's fine though. And on the sides though, it says Nintendo. That's neat. That's neat right there. Does it say on the other side? Oh, okay. That's kind of weird how it doesn't say on the other side, but that's fine. <clears throat> that's fine. I, 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 I like this shirt. Challenger approaching. Now, what else would I would think it would be? I thought it was going to have like all the characters on it. This is better. New Challenger approaching. So this can be a shirt that can go on and on. But the weird thing is the company that made this. Rock me. That's very weird. It's a company. That's what made it. That's kind of a weird company. You know, you'd, you'd think it's an official Nintendo product. But I guess that's what the Loot Crate, like... You know, because this is like a Loot Crate edition. I'm guessing Loot Crate, that's the company that makes the shirts for Loot Crate. I think it's, I think it is, but this is an awesome shirt. I, I love it. I'm gonna wear this, like, hopefully when I'm older, too. When I'm an adult. A adult. That's awesome, though. This goes perfect with everything I got from, Ami from Amiibo Crates. But, let's get to the figures. Screw you, Crate. Oh yeah, I'm trying to do my boxes. Yeah, I know, it kind of sucks that I'm gonna throw away the boxes. I'd rather not keep the amiibo boxes inside of crate. That's just weird. So instead of decided to cut them out and turn them into cards. That's kind of weird. But I'm trying I'm gonna unbox these guys, Ouija and Zelda, um, with a knife. So I'm not gonna show myself because I can't hold a knife and record at the same time. It's very dangerous for me. And I don't wanna cut myself. But these guys look great. Mainly Zelda. Like come on. This is awesome. She looks great. She even looks great as an amiibo. I've heard that some people got derpy ones, just like Marth. My Marth isn't derpy. That derpy. But still. I love my amiibos. I'm sorry, I, I really wish I could have gotten the loser before. Um, and I still need Captain fucking Pit. But, guess what guys? Remember how I was talking about Pit in the live stream? Oh yeah, if you guys checked out the live stream, 
That was fun. But look at that. There's a pit all the way over there. I got it from my friend. My friend was nice enough to go to Best Buy and like hunt for a pit or Captain Falcon or Little Mac. I'm glad he just got pit because pit is really rare. He looks great. And I'm going to do an unboxing video separately for Pit. And I hope it's an unboxing great. Like, with the knife, I hope it's like no... None of those marks. I hope it's actually just... Like, straight. Like, awesomely sliced. Open. That's why I'm using the Legion Zelda for practice. Test dummies. Not exact test dummies. Just tests. Prototypes. Anyways, guys. I'm going to unbox these, uh, and I'll be back. So, I'll be back. Finally back, guys. Anyways. I finally got them out. Uh, I, I really did bad, to be honest. Horrible. I mean, Luigi, yeah. Zelda, not really. I did bad. I might as well just peel them off, to be honest, because that's exactly what it looks like I did. It looks like I literally peeled it off. I, I think I did better with Luigi than Zelda, because that is gone compared to Luigi's. So, I'll definitely do what I did with Luigi, cut it completely through, um, sorry about that, <laughs> cut it completely through, and, um, yeah, hey, at least I got Amiibo cards, though, I'm gonna add them to my collection, <laughs> two more Amiibo cards, yay, but let's get to the figure, come on, come on, come on. let's get to Luigi now, alright, I think it looks great, um, we gotta get some angles with him, though, he looks great. I don't see anything wrong with him. Um, he looks great. Definitely great for an amiibo figure. Um, I don't see any damage on him, so I'm fine with that. Uh, he looks great. He looks like just as a Ouija would look like. Like, no joke. He's got the buttons on the overalls, he's got the gloves. If I can focus on them, you can't really see them because my light in my camera, it's really bad. But, um, yes. Let's see if we can focus a little bit on him. There, uh, uh, I lost it. I had it. I had it. There we go. Alright. So you guys can see a little. Yeah, you can see his gloves now. I was just focusing my camera. But he looks great. Now, I have no complaints about him, and I don't. Uh, actually, I do see a stand. Whoops, I didn't even realize it was a stand. I don't. Uh, the stand looks weird. It, it looks like a. It looks like he's actually not even sliding down. This makes it look stupid. But I would rate Luigi would be a 7. It's not because his figure's fault. It's just the stand. It kills it. Does Mario have a stand? No, he does not have a stand. He doesn't even have anything on his feet. He has no stand. He looks really cool. Especially this fireball. That makes him look cool. But Luigi, they had to give him a stand. That sucks. Hey, Mario. What's up? I have a stand! Wait, what happened to you? I mean, you know, like, that sucks. Mario? I'm sorry. Now, uh, nothing really bad about this figure other than the stand. Like, that's it. That's all I have to complain about. Whoops. Alright, but hey, we got a new figure. Let's add him. Alright, so we got Mario. Luigi. You know what? I'll just leave him like that. I'll, I'll do that later. Alright, Luigi. You're a good figure, but that stand. So, a 7. That's all right. Let's get Zelda out of here. And uh, things back in there. Alright, I got it. Once again, it has that annoying thing in the bottom. It's not really annoying, it's good. Alright, let's get into Zelda, though. A lot of people are wondering about this, I bet. Zelda doesn't look derpy. People are saying she looks dumb. I don't think she looks dumb. She looks great. Really great. Uh, not to be a pervert, uh, or perverted. Oh my gosh, is that a stand? Are you kidding me? Why the heck would she need a stand there? I mean, maybe she had problems standing up, but why the heck did she need a stand right there? Somebody could easily trick you and say, Hey, you wanna buy the Zelda amiibo? It doesn't have any stance, so that makes it really valuable. The guy buys it. Okay, I got my first Zelda. Oh my gosh, I got a Zelda amiibo. I got a Zelda amiibo. Let's see if it has any stands. It has a stand. I have been tricked! But, but the box art, box, but the box art, it, 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 it never showed a stand. I look under a dress. No, it's a stand. It's purple. That's what I would feel for you guys for. 
although her, um, she's got some great art on her, on her dress. Uh, yeah. Great art? I'm not joking. A lot of accessories in her. She looks great. Um, uh, nothing to complain about other than the stand. So, two new Amiibos with stands. Great. And... Why? Seriously, but why? Why does she have to have a stand? That's stupid. This amiibo looks great, though. I would rate her uh, eight. Eight. We use a seven. Zelda's an eight. Now, if you do have a Mario amiibo, I recommend for sure you get Luigi, because Mario cannot live without his brother. And Luigi's actually really cool. I like him. I love him. He's a nice character in Smash Bros. But the stand kills it. That's all I have to say. Just like we Fit Runner. Her stand just kills it. It looks like she's not even doing the pose on purpose. It looks like she's been forced to. They put crazy glue on her foot. So, she's not really posing. That's what it looks like. Same with Fox. It doesn't look like he's actually trying to float. He has stands to make him float. To, or make him look like he's floating. Because he's actually in the air. If you take out the stand, he actually is not in the air. Like, I mean, he's not on the ground. What am I saying? On the ground. He's not on the ground. He's not. He's in the air right now. It looks like he's coming out of his uh, left or right uh, special move. You know, I forgot what it's called, but he like swashes through. And it looks like he's about to fall down. But it looks like he. Like, it literally looks like they're trying to make him go on the ground. I mean, that would be weird having a Meepo that floats. So I guess the stand's acceptable, but at least have like a clear one or something. Like a tiny one. You don't, why the heck do you need this little bump right there? Just have a, just, like, like seriously, it's dumb. All right, but that's fine. I mean, it's amiibos. What do you think? Just like Link, his kills him too as well. Cause that's just stupid. That's stupid. Link, you're a good amiibo figure, but that stand kills it. Same with Donkey Kong. Look at this. Wow. That's just like that's just annoying. Diddy Kong has one as well. Like, that's it. Those are a lot of characters with stands. And these two are one of them. Doesn't mean I hate the figures by heart. It just makes the figures look dumb. Like, hey, it's a Luigi Amiibo. I got a Luigi Amiibo. I got a Luigi Amiibo. I got a Luigi Amiibo. I'm so happy. It's a stand. Oh, it kind of looks lame. I mean, it's funny. He's doing a funny pose. But why does he have a stand? It looks like he's been forced to or something. Yeah, that's fine though. Um, like I said, seven, eight out of ten. But well, thank you guys all for watching this Amiibo crate unboxing. I will still unbox Amiibo figures that I get, like Pit. Like I showed you guys earlier, I got a Pit Amiibo. Very excited to open that one, and I ordered a Captain Falcon online, not like pre-ordering. I actually bought it on eBay for thirty bucks. I think it was a ripoff. It's my fault for not pre-ordering, though. I couldn't pre-order. I, I definitely did this time, though. I'm going to pre-order the Wave 3 Amiibos. I pre-ordered 4 out of uh, 11. And I can't pre-order 4. Also, the exclusive to the stores. I mean, I did hear there was, like, some, like, cards that you can do it and you can order them at the store. It costs money still. So I, I, I'll think, uh, I know Toys R Us does that for Lucario, and I want to see if I can find it before it's too late. But thank you guys all for watching. Um, thank you guys all for watching for the Loot Crate uh, Amiibos. Definitely thanks for staying tuned to watch the other Amiibo crates. And go ahead and check out my other Amiibo unboxings. Like, that, it's fun. Um, yeah, guys. That's all I gotta say. Thank you guys all for watching. Um, and see you guys next time. And, uh, Pit unboxing. And then Captain Falcon and some other ones. Anyways, guys, see ya. Peace.